A bizarre crime in Hartford County. Police say a bank teller broke into a home after someone came into the bank where he worked and took out a bunch of cash. WJZ is live tonight. Rachel Menentoff explains how police were able to crack this case. Rachel. Rick, police learned that prior to the home invasion, the victim withdrew a large amount of money from the bank where the suspect worked. That's why police believe that the suspect was motivated by cash. 19 year old Nathan Michael Newell has been arrested and charged with home invasion, robbery, and assault. He's now being held at the Harford County Detention Center without bail. Police say Newell worked as a bank teller at a local bank. They're not disclosing which bank that is, but say it's cooperating with their investigation. Police say that Newell broke into a home on Still Pond Way in Bel Air and assaulted the 78 year old homeowner. It happened earlier this week. Another person inside the home was able to call police. Meanwhile, Newell ran away by the time they arrived, but a ring doorbell camera caught him fleeing the scene and helped police track him down. Sheriff Jeff Gaylor says throughout his career in law enforcement, he hasn't seen a case quite like this one. In 34 years now doing law enforcement, uh, I, I can't think of another case before where it's almost like a reverse bank robbery where the uh, teller is actually the one gleaning the information that this might be an attractive target and the the victim in this case instead of being the bank is the customer coming in you know hoping hoping for service both of the people who were inside the home were treated for injuries they sustained during the altercation with the suspect i've been told that both of them have since been released from the hospital we're live tonight in harford county i'm rachel menatoff for wjz